My area of research is in regenerative medicine. Specifically, we're focused on biomaterials enhanced uh, stem cell based therapies. What this means is that we develop polymer scaffolds and these are used either as implants, which we implant into the patient, and these would allow the patient's own stem cells to be stimulated, to migrate into the implants, to grow and then to differentiate. The other way that we induce the um, healing is we would see stem cells directly into these environments and then we transplant both the environment and the stem cells into the patient. So in either way, we are repairing a wound or usually it would be an organ that is failing. This is the department. It's a really good environment. Um, the university itself has a very strong materials group. It's got wonderful clinicians and it's got administrators who are very accessible. The prefect has been wonderful. I can talk to the dean, I can talk to the rector. I think it's a really, really nice environment for a researcher to be in. 316, so you're normal. I think Leo is pretty unique. Uh, it's got a very applied approach to research, which is something that I really like. And I think also the attitude is something that I haven't encountered before, and I think that's really good, the, the amount of support that we're getting, and the fact that the people are accessible, you know, all the way from the prefect to the rector, it's easy for me to just send them an email and then I get a response. Um, it's really different from the system I'm used to, and this is something that I'm really happy about. I guess for the next little while I'll be very busy trying to recruit people. We're getting a GMP lab built. We have the research labs to reconfigure. And the other thing is uh, to try and get some funding for an advanced translational biotherapeutic center so that we can actually get our results into patients. I'm thinking that with the colleagues, that we would recruit to the regenerative medicine program. Uh, we should be very busy and I guess I'll be keeping very, very busy.